In this video, we're going to explore a powerful concept. Understanding certain principles can make anything possible. Whether you're aiming to achieve personal goals, enhance your career, or simply improve your everyday life, grasping these ideas can be a game changer. We'll look into how your beliefs and actions influence your outcomes backed by psychological insights and universal laws that help shape our existence. Belief is not just a feeling, it's a powerful force that shapes our reality. The foundation of achieving anything starts in the mind, and it is your beliefs that dictate your actions and ultimately your outcomes. Think about it. Every action starts with a thought, and these thoughts are heavily influenced by what you believe is possible. If you believe you can improve, learn a new skill, or overcome a challenge, you're more likely to take the steps necessary to make that happen. Psychology supports this idea extensively. Studies have shown that individuals who hold strong, positive beliefs about their capabilities engage more readily in tasks, show greater perseverance, and are more resilient in the face of difficulties. This isn't just about being optimistic. It's about setting a foundation for what you're capable of achieving. When you start with the belief that something is possible, you set the stage for making it a reality. But how do you cultivate such beliefs? It begins with self-awareness. Reflect on the narratives you tell yourself daily. Are they empowering or limiting? The first step to transforming your beliefs is recognizing those that hold you back. Replacing them with empowering beliefs doesn't happen overnight, but through consistent practice and affirmation, you can start to see yourself and your possibilities in a new light. Moving on to a fundamental principle that governs not just the physical world, but our personal lives as well, the principle of cause and effect. This universal law, often summed up as, as you sow, so shall you reap, is crucial in understanding how to make anything possible. It teaches us that every action has a corresponding reaction, and when applied to personal goals, it emphasizes the importance of taking intentional actions that align with your desired outcomes. Why is this principle so important? Because it underscores the power of personal accountability. To harness the principle of cause and effect, you must first accept full responsibility for your actions and their outcomes. When you understand that your current situation is a result of past actions, you empower yourself to take charge and change your future outcomes through different actions. And for instance, if you aim to improve your health, the cause might be regular exercise and proper nutrition. The effect, expectedly, would be better health and increased vitality. The clarity of this relationship helps in planning and executing your actions more effectively. It also promotes a proactive mindset where you are not merely reacting to life's events, but actively shaping them to your advantage. In applying this principle, start small. Identify one area of your life where you desire change and map out the causes and effects clearly. What specific actions can you take today that will lead to the outcomes you want tomorrow? This methodical approach not only simplifies complex goals, but also helps in tracking progress and making necessary adjustments along the way. Visualization is a powerful tool that can significantly influence the achievement of your goals. By creating vivid mental images of your desired outcomes, you stimulate the same neural networks that actual physical activity does. This means that when you visualize yourself succeeding, you're mentally preparing your brain to enact those very successes in real life. Let's delve into how visualization can be effectively utilized. Think about a goal you have. Perhaps it's delivering an excellent presentation at work, running a marathon, or learning a new language. When you visualize, you're not just daydreaming passively, you're actively constructing the experience in your mind. 
Imagine yourself preparing for the presentation, feeling confident, engaging with your audience, and receiving positive feedback. This mental rehearsal boosts your confidence and refines your real-world performance. To practice, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. Close your eyes and take a few deep breaths to relax. Now start constructing the scene in your mind vividly. Include as many details as possible, what you are wearing, how you feel, what the setting looks like, and even the smells and sounds around you. The more detailed your visualization, the more effective it will be in motivating and preparing you for the actual event. Building on visualization, another essential component in making anything possible is cultivating a growth mindset. This concept, popularized by psychologist Carol Dweck, refers to the belief that your abilities and intelligence can be developed over time through dedication and hard work. Unlike a fixed mindset, which assumes that capabilities are static and unchangeable, a growth mindset thrives on challenge and sees failures not as evidence of unintelligence, but as heartening springboards for growth and for stretching our existing abilities. How does one cultivate a growth mindset? It starts with changing how you view challenges and obstacles. Embrace challenges as opportunities to learn rather than insurmountable barriers. When you face a setback, instead of telling yourself you're not good enough, ask yourself, what can I learn from this experience? This shift in perspective can transform the way you approach every aspect of your life. Another practical way to develop a growth mindset is to praise the process rather than the outcome. For instance, instead of congratulating yourself merely for success, recognize the effort, planning, and strategies that led to that success. This reinforces the belief that you can influence your success through your actions and decisions. And together, visualization and a growth mindset create a robust framework for achieving your goals. By mentally preparing for success and embracing a flexible and resilient approach to learning and challenges, you lay down the foundations for making anything possible. Persistence is the key to unlocking the door to success. It is the quality that allows you to continue striving towards your goal even when faced with difficulties and setbacks. This relentless pursuit is essential because most goals worth achieving require time, effort, and continuous dedication. To illustrate the power of persistence without specific examples, consider the process of learning a new skill. Initially, progress might be slow and challenges may seem daunting. However, persistence involves pushing forward, practicing consistently, and improving step by step. Each small effort contributes to gradual improvement, eventually leading to mastery. One effective way to foster persistence is by setting smaller, manageable goals that lead to larger achievements. This breakdown makes the process less overwhelming and provides frequent moments of success, which can motivate you to keep pushing forward. Moreover, maintaining a positive outlook and reminding yourself of the reasons behind your pursuit can reinforce your will to persevere. Adaptability is an essential trait in today's ever-changing world. It refers to your ability to adjust to new conditions and effectively handle uncertainty. In the context of making anything possible, adaptability means being open to new methods, ideas, and changes that can lead to better outcomes. To develop adaptability, start by embracing change rather than resisting it. When faced with a new situation, instead of defaulting to how things have always been done, ask yourself how you can leverage these new circumstances to your advantage. This might mean adopting new technologies, altering your approach based on feedback, or even changing your goal as you learn more about the possibilities. Furthermore, actively seek out new experiences and challenges. This could involve taking on projects outside of your usual scope, learning new skills, or simply changing your routine. Each new experience is an opportunity to learn and grow, which not only makes you more adaptable, but also more competent in various aspects of your life. Together, persistence and adaptability form a powerful duo.
While persistence pushes you to keep going despite difficulties, adaptability ensures that you are flexible and efficient in your approach. This combination not only increases your chances of success, but also prepares you to thrive in any situation, making the seemingly impossible within reach. Effective goal setting is crucial in turning the abstract into the tangible. It provides a clear roadmap of where you want to go and how you plan to get there. Setting goals effectively is not just about deciding what you want to achieve, but also about understanding and planning the steps necessary to reach those achievements. When setting goals, it's important to make them smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. This framework ensures that your goals are well-defined and trackable, which increases the likelihood of achieving them. For example, rather than setting a vague goal like get better at public speaking, a smart goal would be deliver three public speeches by the end of the quarter with positive feedback from 80% of the audience. Another key aspect of effective goal setting is writing your goals down. This simple act makes your goals real and tangible, not just thoughts floating in your mind. It also allows you to revisit and revise your goals as needed, ensuring they remain relevant as circumstances change. Building on effective goal setting, the next step is understanding and leveraging the science of habits. Habits are the small decisions and actions that you perform every day. According to researchers, habits account for about 40% of our behaviors on any given day, which means that they have a massive impact on our overall life outcomes. The process of habit formation involves three main components, the cue, the routine, and the reward. The cue triggers your brain to initiate a behavior. The routine is the behavior itself, and the reward is the benefit you gain from the behavior. Understanding this cycle can help you break bad habits and build new, more productive ones. To develop new habits, start by identifying a clear cue and a rewarding reward that motivates you to stick to the routine. For instance, if your goal is to read more books, you might set a cue of reading every night before bed and reward yourself with a small treat after finishing a chapter. Over time, this practice can become automatic, making it easier to maintain your new habit without relying on constant willpower. As we continue to explore ways to make anything possible, it's essential to recognize the role of networking and relationships. Building strong, supportive connections can open up a wealth of opportunities and resources that might otherwise be inaccessible. It's not just about expanding your social circle, it's about creating meaningful relationships that can mutually benefit all involved. To begin building a robust network, focus on how you can be of service to others rather than just what you can gain. Attend events and engage in communities relevant to your interests and professional goals. Make a genuine effort to listen and learn about the people you meet. This approach not only helps you understand how to better contribute to these relationships, but also builds trust and respect, which are the cornerstones of any strong network. Additionally, leverage technology to maintain these connections. Use social media platforms and professional networking sites to keep in touch and share useful information. Regular interaction, even if it's digital, helps keep relationships strong and can be instrumental when you need advice, support, or opportunities to collaborate. While pursuing your goals, it's vital to not overlook the importance of self-care and maintaining good mental health. Achieving anything significant often requires hard work and can sometimes lead to stress and burnout if not managed properly. By taking care of your mental and physical well-being, you ensure that you have the energy and mental clarity needed to pursue your objectives. Incorporate regular self-care routines into your daily schedule. This could be as simple as ensuring you get enough sleep, taking short breaks during work, engaging in physical activities, or practicing mindfulness and meditation. 
These activities help manage stress and enhance overall well-being, making you more resilient and focused. Additionally, be mindful of the signs of burnout, such as chronic fatigue, decreased motivation, or feelings of emptiness. Recognizing these signs early can help you take steps to realign with your health priorities, perhaps by adjusting your goals, seeking professional help, or temporarily stepping back to recharge. As we wrap up our discussion on how understanding certain principles can make anything possible, let's recap the key insights we've explored today. We began by understanding the immense power of belief and how it shapes our reality. We delved into the principle of cause and effect, emphasizing personal accountability and the importance of intentional action. Visualization and cultivating a growth mindset were highlighted as crucial tools for mental preparation and resilience. Persistence and adaptability were discussed as essential traits for overcoming challenges and thriving in a changing world. Effective goal setting and the science of habits were also crucial topics helping us see how structured planning and routine behaviors lead to success. We examined the significant role of networking and the impact of building strong, supportive relationships on achieving our goals. Lastly, we stressed the importance of self-care and mental health, underscoring that maintaining our well-being is foundational to pursuing and achieving any significant endeavor. Now that you've gained these insights, I encourage you to take a proactive step. Choose one principle we discussed that resonated the most with you. Perhaps it's the power of belief, or maybe it's the science of habits. Begin to integrate this principle into your daily life. Start small, set a specific achievable goal related to this principle. Write it down, plan the steps you'll take, and start acting on it today. Remember, the journey to making anything possible begins with a single step. And with each step you take, you're not only moving closer to your goal, but also transforming yourself into someone capable of achieving even greater things. Keep pushing forward, stay adaptable, and take care of yourself along the way. Thank you for spending this time with me. Your dedication to personal growth and self-improvement is the first step toward making your dreams a reality. Keep striving, keep learning, and remember that the power to make anything possible lies within you. 